welcome back to my channel. If you are new, my name is Kelsey. If you are not new, I truly appreciate you coming back. So two things out of the gate, hair. Um, my hair is in a ponytail for I think the first time on this channel. It's A, very dirty, um, and B, I got to work this morning, like got to work at 4 a.m. and it is now 3.07. So we're just kind of rolling with the hair Second, my thumbs. So I did an at-home gel manicure yesterday and the nail polish I was using was like brand new. So the layers didn't quite dry. Um, so they peeled off this morning, but that's okay. Just wanted to point them out because I feel like whenever I notice like one fingernail notice, whenever I notice one finger like one finger without nail polish on someone i can't stop staring at it so i am acknowledging that i know it's there i'm going to touch it up after this video didn't do it before because i don't know why anywho let's hop into the video so today i am going to be reviewing my personal favorite flare leggings now i'm pretty sure that i already know which one i'm gonna choose but we're gonna go through them um i do only have three, I mean kind of four, but three definitely that I am going to be comparing. I have worn all three of these, um, so they're not new to me. I'm just kind of picking which one I like best. Okay, so off the bat, first one we're going to be doing is the Buff Bunny Flo Foxy Flare Legging. Um, that one has kind of like a legacy fit. I have it right here. I don't know why I'm not pulling it out. So it is in this beautiful dark brown color. They do have a bunch of colors, I think, still available in these, but I just really like this brown for fall. Um, like I said, this is their Foxy Flare from their 70s collection, I think it was. Um, these are $74 with a 31 inch inseam, and it does, like I said, have kind of that legacy fit going on back here. Next up is going to be the Halara Pat It Off Flare Leggings. These um, have kind of more of that ribbed fabric going on here. These are $39.95 and it actually didn't give me an inseam, but these are the Super Flare Pat It Off by Halara. Okay, and then lastly, we do have the Vitality Flare Leggings. So when I said I kind of have four, I got the regular length and I got the long length in the Vitality Flare Leggings. And I don't like the long length ex unless it's I'm just in the house. I don't mind it in the house, but going outside, I will walk that like back part off just because it literally goes underneath my foot. And I don't like that. Um, so I don't like the long, which get that out of the way. I am 5'7". It's way too long on me. The regular length, I will say is more perfect for me. So let's get these on and let's kind of talk through the review and then I'm going to let you know which one I think is my favorite and then if I end up picking that one I'll let you know and I'll just let you know no matter what. So let's let's get into the try on. Okay so first up we do have the Buff Bunny Foxy Flare Leggings. These are in the color Brady Brown and they do have that legacy fit that I was talking about. 31 inch inseam and these are pretty much the perfect length. Um, if I wear these out, I am not going to step all over them. They hit me at a pretty good spot. Let me see if I can move you. Okay, so I'm trying my best, but that it only goes back so far and apparently my camera can't get it. So you can see a little bit better but these pretty much feel like the regular legacy legging. And then right about here, it turns into a flare or a yoga pant. Um, I really like these. I love the fit because I do love the legacy leggings. So it does have that legacy contour going on right over the glutes, which I really like. Um, the rise on these goes right to the bottom of my rib cage. I will get some rolling, but that is just my body. I really enjoy these. The only critique that I do have is I don't know if I'm a fan of this like suction cut 
bell bottom look. Like it's just not my favorite look overall. So the price on these is $74. So they are going to be our middle price today. I do really like these, would buy these in other colors. I think I know which one my favorite is. So it's not these, it's not these, but these are number two. I will say that as far as my brain goes with wearing them and kind of like where I placed them originally, these are gonna be second. So next on the chopping block, we do have the Halara Pat It Off Super Flare Leggings. These do have the crossover waistband going on, really tight compression up in the waistline, which I don't mind, I like some compression. First thing I'm gonna note is there is a front seam, so that immediately dings a couple of points. I do like the transition to the flare on this one a little bit better. I don't know if the camera's picking it up, but it starts to flare at the knee versus halfway down my calf. So that really, I do feel a difference in that, just wearing them. I also feel like I can see a difference. I really enjoy these. I do think that the fabric, since the lining does go vertically, it is kind of going to give you a little bit of a more like slim illusion going on. It does have a pocket going on in the back. So if you want to put any like keys, chapstick, snacks and put snacks and definitely put snacks um snacks back there you can fit it so there's not much of a glute seam contouring thing going on which i don't mind if i'm wearing the flare leggings these are most likely not going in the gym so i don't mind that i i really like these the other ones feel more like a legging these feel more like a compressive legging so the other ones feel more like a lifestyle very, very comfortable, but these are definitely, you're gonna notice them on your body a little bit more, but not necessarily in a bad way. And then one more thing I did want to note, so the waistband here is pretty thin, I would say, comparing to other like yoga or leggings. <laughs> and it cuts me at a weird spot right around the waist, which it really, I feel like, accentuates my lower pooch that I have going on here. And I don't love that look for me. So that's the reason that these are sitting at number three right now. Oh, there's a kitty. Hi, you want to be my friend? I want a cat. I'm going to kidnap one from outside. <laughs> um, so these are, that's why that's, these are my number three. The front seam, I don't think it's flattering. The pooch accentuation, I obviously am not a fan of. I do like the gradual flare um, more than the Buff Bunny ones. But if it comes to which one am I gonna choose, it's gonna be the Buff Bunny over these. And that's just my honest opinion. process of elimination these are my favorite so these are the vitality flare leggings these are $85 they are the most expensive pant that we're going to be talking about today they are currently running sales all the time so you might be able to get your hands on a pair on sale I don't know how they're doing that but keep your eye peeled eyes peeled I love these I love the way that they fit so these are going to be a cloud fabric and then the the short actually start, or yeah, so the short length actually starts at 31, which is what the Buff Bunny ones are. So that'll kind of give you a good point of reference for the short ones. The regular ones are like 33, which I have here. I am 5'7", and these are the perfect length for me to wear outside with shoes because you will get a little bit of that rise, and I like the way that it looks better with shoes. Uh, the long is 36 which it is long, you guys. <laughs> I feel like you need to be honestly around six foot to be able to wear them normal. They are great. I love that they have length options. Um, one thing about these that I really do like that the other two do not have. So right here, you can see we do have a slit actually, which I really like. It gives you a little bit more movement as well as it like kind of shows your shoes which is kind of nice, but then sometimes it's kind of like, 
you got to think about which shoes. I don't mind. So we do have the classic cloud fit up top, as I was saying. So it's going to be that same waistband. Again, lower pooch, no, not really much support. And then we do have their glute contour with the minimalism on the branding, which I really enjoy. So these are going to be my favorite. I really, really like these. I gravitate towards them pretty much every day that I'm not going to work or like just looking like a scrub. They're great, you can dress up, dress down. If you want me to do like a styling video, I can because I have coming, been coming up with some really cute outfits. Um, if you don't follow me over on Instagram or TikTok, make sure you head on over there, give me a follow, it's just Kelsey Ellen. I did forget to mention, if you do wanna try out anything from Havara, I do have a code. It is Kelsey B, and that will save you 20%. So I don't get any commission off of this. This is just letting them know that hey, I sent you and we'd love to work together. So if you guys have any questions, please leave them in the comments below. But other than that, I'll see you in the next video.